which is channel 22 right here on Cablevision. So let's find out more from the doggy moms themselves. They're right here on Vet Talk, and two of them have actually appeared on the show recently. So let us welcome Ashley, who is here with Misty and Max, two beautiful Pomeranians. We've got Erica, who is here with her beautiful Ginger, who's a Yorkie, and Cubby, who is a beautiful Westie. We've got Grace, who is here with a Portia, and Rosie, dressed to the nines, just like Mom. We've got Karen with her cute little Eli, a gorgeous little Chihuahua, and Leslie, who is here with Sally Sue, a wonderful little Yorkie. So welcome, everybody. I really, the show is absolutely adorable. It is upbeat. It is fun. So I encourage all of our viewers to uh, definitely tune in and uh, see for yourselves why these ladies are so much fun and they're furry kids. If you have an animal, you will so be able to relate. So I'm going to start out with you, Ashley, with your beautiful little Pomeranians. Uh, I want you to give everybody an idea of what the show is all about for those of uh, the few that maybe haven't seen it and those who are going to tune in and see because it's really just tons of fun. Um, well, the show is basically um, follows the five of us and our fabulous fur kids and just all the different events and um, contests, competitions, and whatnot. And the escapades of your doggies as well. And the and drama. And, and the, the drama, drama right. But it's, it's not mean drama. It's fun drama. And I have to say one of my favorite episodes was you who did this really adorable, it sounds a little sexy, but it was very adorable, sort of like a little burlesque with the doggies. It was, and I love that. I got a real kick out of that. Um, I've actually danced my whole life, so but I've never done doggy bur or burlesque, rather. So doggy burlesque was interesting. And it's hard to manipulate the two dogs. And I'm balancing, trying to, you know, take off layers. And I, I started off with, like, this huge moo-moo, of course, because I knew I wasn't going to get down to nothing at all. So That's the thing. It was, was so fun. fun. I definitely like to do it again because now we just have a better idea of, you know, how things run. So Right. It was really, really cute. That was fun. Um, Erica, you were just really on the show not that long ago here. We did a fashion show with your beautiful babies, and you were here, and they look beautiful today. Tell me, how did you get involved, Erica? <laughs> Well, all of us are doggy moms, and I was just really active in the community, going to charity events, and my dog's a therapy dog, so we were out and about, and it was just a perfect fit for the show to promote dog adoption, promote getting out there and having fun with your dog and doing good in the community at the same time. You really stress the importance of adoption, uh, rescue events, and I like that too. You were just at a big one uh, in New Rochelle, actually. Oh, thank for the you Humane very Society. much. Yeah. Yes, um, um, New Rochelle Humane Society hundredth uh, anniversary, and uh, and they made a special guest, which was quite nice, and gave us an award. And I don't know if all that was deserved, but um, it's very rewarding to uh, to do all the charity work we do and and to go to the events and. Uh, support all these wonderful organizations and and do whatever you know s small part that, that we can do and a lot of times you know we're having a, a great time in the process uh either with our dogs and sometimes without our dogs but it's always you know great fun and at, at the end of the day it's it's just so win-win because we're giving money where we you know where, where it can help on oh, the absolutely. rescues it's, so. you're, you're giving back, and I, the, the outfits are absolutely adorable. And I remember in your party episode, uh, you encouraged people to, yes, bring gifts, but you were making sure that you liked the way they looked on your dog. <laughs> and it was so cute. It was just so funny. You know, I said no gifts. You say, oh, you said no, no gifts, gifts because you wanted to make sure that they looked great. Well, yeah, well they're like wearing their, their fa you know, one of their favorite designers here, um, a band at Rubio Design. So, yeah. you know, Which, with the hats. Of course, Tony's been on the show. Yes. Uh, with yes. this wonderful little bandit, and yes. he's going to be on again. So that, that's Real, really okay. fabulous. Um, uh, Karen, um, you also involved in a lot of charity events. I've actually seen you at the pre-Westminster fashion yes. show. Uh, really uh, giving back a lot. When I adopted Eli, he had yeah. had several owners and um, needed knee surgery. And I had always had a hard time with relationships with men. And through getting him, something changed in my life completely. And it's like this world has opened up for both of us. And it's, I just can't even describe it. It's like the spiritual catharsis that happened from getting him. Right. And um, I just think it's really important to give back. This is a perfect example, again, of not only having fun, but uh, showing people the importance of adopting. And look at him, and boy, does he look spiffy, and he's matching you. 
in your outfit, mm -hmm. and good for you too that he's changed your life as well. Mm -hmm. um, Leslie, you have the beautiful little Sally Sue there. Yeah. Do you have a favorite episode? You have fun doing the show. Do you encourage people out there to oh, take yeah. a look and watch and follow it? Of course, my favorite episode would be the Barking Beauty episode, the very last episode, which we're going to talk about in our <laughs> next segment. <laughs> um, but I just, I just had so much fun going to the events because I'm kind of new to getting out there and doing other events other than my Barking Beauty event. And um, it was so great to see how many events in the city there really, really are and how many really great people are involved in, in charity work for animal shelters and rescue organizations. It's it was, wonderful. Yeah. yeah, and it's wonderful that all of you who are on this great show, remember everybody, it's called Doggy Moms, um, really expresses that, and that's one of the things about the show that really is so important. It's fun, it's upbeat, uh, you encourage adoption, you encourage, of course, loving your pets and even dressing them at times, which is really a lot of fun as well. Uh, also, you gals are going to appear in September at the NYC Media event. That will be in Central Park. You can meet the Doggy Moms, which you really want to do. Doggy Moms, you can all catch. It is on Sundays at 10 p.m. on Channel 22, the NYC Life Channel. That is Sunday, 10 to 10.30, Channel 22. You really have to catch it. I, you will just love it. Also, you can become a fan of the Doggy Moms on Facebook by going to their Facebook page and tune into the episodes and hope for another season. Thank you all for being Thank here. You Thank so you, much. one and all. We'll be right back.